there's no doubt anymore that China is among the premier economic forces in the global economy. We have to take account of their views in many respects, and they have a lot of interest in how this whole system will evolve. So I think it's, it's sort of a recognition of the ascendancy of China and the economic sphere. I think the, the other aspect of the discussions that might interest a lot of the leaders is what's going on with this growing sentiment against globalization. You saw it with respect to the vote on Brexit in the UK, but in the United States there's been a lot of concern here in the United States, but I think principally in other countries that listen to the debate here about what's going on with Trump's anti-trade rhetoric, anti-immigration rhetoric. This is key to countries, particularly in Asia, who have emphasized the importance of a global economy as promoting the growth of their own uh, situation uh, and would be very disturbed to see a reaction back against that and sort of like a growth in autarky.